Hey Tubas, today we're going to learn at, about how to make a sound on our mouthpiece. So we have already been playing with the straw and we've already been using lots and lots and lots of air. Now we're just going to put that on a mouthpiece. Make sure you have your mirror up ready to go so that you can see yourself. When I place the mouthpiece on my face, I wanna make sure it's in the center of my lips, okay? And not touching my nose. So if you're like me and have a short distance between your nose and upper lip, it has to be low enough that it's not, you don't want it right underneath your nose. Make sure it's in the center of your lips. Now, I'm going to breathe in for two counts and just blow air out for four counts. Do that with me. Place the mouthpiece in the center. One, two, and three. Okay, so that's four counts. Try it again. One. Two deep breath. Good. Now, this time, if I just bring my lips a little bit closer together, they're going to actually buzz. You're going to get a sound like this. And try that with me. Here we go. Make sure you're holding your mouthpiece on the shank. You probably need a few fingers there to make sure it's being held. One, two, and Try it again, and... Try to get a nice, nice, steady buzz and make it last as long as possible. Work on that every single day, trying to get that nice, steady buzz that's really, really, really relaxed. Now, if your sound is really high, way up here, you're just a little bit tight. So loosen your lips. On tuba, the mouthpiece is really, really big. So your lips are going to buzz a lot, kind of like that. So the lower sound you can get on the tuba mouthpiece, the better it's going to be in the long run for you guys. But be practicing that and we'll get that on the instrument soon.